How's it going, YouTube? Welcome back to another exciting episode for Shumi Gang. My mom just couldn't wait and she just started child. So, we are prepping something very special today. Uh, something that I've been talking about that my mom, this is my mama, right? Because there she's, I feel tall. She's the only person that makes me feel tall. But we are going to cook this. You guys ready for this? Yeah. We got the burbot. So, we got the burbot. It's a little slimy, so I'm going to keep it up up here. Danny is my cameraman, so yeah. and yes, me and my brother Danny are brothers. You guys are wondering. <laughs> my pops is in this too, but we're prepping bourbon right now. We're gonna do a Thai dish. We're gonna do the banana leaf dish, okay? And only my mom knows how to do that. I kind of know how to do it, but I don't really trust my instinct. She's just going ham, like she's just cooking right now. So enjoy the video. We're gonna go ahead and shoot some, a bunch of B rolls. We're gonna eat. This is to catch a cook, and I don't know. It's a nice little Thai dish that she learned when she was back in the. Uh, in Thailand or Laos, Laos, yeah, Laos, and this is something really tasty. I had it in the past when I was a kid. I always ate this. My mom made it with catfish, walleye, everything you can think of. Any freshwater fish, it's delicious. I recommend you guys to try it. Here I am. I'm gonna show you guys how it's done. Well, I'm not showing you guys, but my mom is. So, all right, stay tuned, and I'll see you guys during the bureau. So, yeah. All right, guys. So, um. I guess I, sh I shouldn't be doing this. We are prepping a bourbon today. So here it is. Um, it's a delicious fish. And like I said, I know I don't eat too much fish, okay? But I, I am making a exception because my mom was like, dude, you caught some. Um, I'm going to come over. Do you have a mo knife and all this? I'm like, no, no, no. I don't have anything of that. And I feel so like, like I failed her. You know? I don't have all the things that she needs. So she went and bought all this stuff. So shout out to her. She even brought me some rice. I ran out of rice. And we're gonna prep this bourbon. This delicious fish. Danny's just gonna shoot the B-roll of me cutting it. You guys see my like recent video. I already like showed you guys how to prep it. But we're just gonna, you know, cut it up and then Yeah, this is exciting. I'm like, it's been a while since I had this dish and me and Danny both. So yeah, let's do this. Hold on, I'm nervous. You nervous? Yeah. Because I'm cooking for a month. So he's making my batch. Yep, making Danny's batch right here. Alright, that's good enough. That's it. That's All right. Ready? Ready? Yeah, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm soaking in sea salt because I know Danny's not a fan of like too fishy taste to it, but this is what I like to do, get all that nasty gunk stuff off. It is delicious. Like your number two. What time, huh? My mom is like, you're wasting food, son. You must be abandoned and disowned. Okay. My mom's saying that just cut it into like two pieces. Okay, we'll do three, mom. We'll do three. Alright, so there it is. It's in here. Alright. Oh, this right here is what I'm talking about. Yeah. Alright, I think sushi's ready. Alright, guys, so. Yeah. Ooh, look at that, boys! Put a little salt in there. MSG. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uncle Roger style. Hey. Yeah. All right. Brings back to childhood memories. <laughs> My mom is saying that I don't have this like certain Asian ingredient. And um, I failed it once again. <laughs> Danny, man. <laughs> How can you do this? Yeah, I don't have it in my house. She was like, why didn't you tell me you have it at home? All right, so we got it all mixed up in like these this nice Thai herb. Like it's it smells amazing. Like my mom just rocks. So all right, what should we do with this? Hold on. Oh, Jonas. All right. My mom do not speak English, guys. So I'm sorry. 
Right, let's do this. Cho tan cho. Cho tan no. Cho thì ok nhá. Oh, they just want the whole thing yeah, in there. Okay, mua chẳng chút lọt cho thì chút. Oh, got you, got you. Okay, okay. Cho chút lọt cho nhau. That looks Ooh, good. We eating good, boy. And then, can you record this? Yeah. Oh, see, man, it smells so good. Yes, yes. Wow. Okay, just to go back, I'll go back more a little bit. So my mom's gonna put aluminum foil over it only because uh, normally what she would do is She'll wrap it in banana leaf and she'll fold the banana leaf into like a like a like a burrito, and she'll put that over like charcoal or uh, a grill, right? But we don't have that right now. It's kind of dark outside and it's cold. It's like 20 degrees. Yeah, I don't know, man. I'm just really excited. Danny, are you excited? Oh yeah, I'm excited. All right, here, here. Look, look, Danny's face. Are you excited? I'm so excited. <laughs> so yeah. Um, Alright, so I'm really excited. Uh, this is not like not the best planning video for uh, you guys because I was just like, hey mom, like get over here. I want you to start making this dish so that I can record. So okay, she got in and she just started like prepping everything. It didn't even give me a chance to like start it up. So uh, this is what it is. Hopefully you guys get a gist of it and we're gonna go ahead and do some like, taste test in a while. So medium heat. So you guys wanna make sure it's so medium heat. Yep. Yeah, okay. 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 Yeah, yeah. Okay. So my mom's saying that I gotta like uh, prep, not prep, make sure I add water to it once it evaporates and I, I'm slow cooking it pretty much. Again, like I said, normally we would just fold it and put it on top of the grill and wait until the banana leaves start blistering and then it's flip it over pretty much is ready. But here, we kind of do it with the aluminum style and it is delicious. So. Anyways, um, this is the banana leaf. You guys are wondering. It smells my home. Show them the case. It smells like my home. So this is the banana. banana. Yep. So what does it say? Banana leaves frozen. So they do come frozen. You can find this like at an Asian market. Anyways, yeah, I can't really name any of the Asian stores because I'm not. Maybe because of copyrights. So if you guys are looking for sponsoring, uh, yeah, hit me up, and I'm only to do some banana leaf for the video for you guys. Anyways, they smell delicious, and uh, that's what we're cooking it in. So swing over here, Dean. So did you see here? You can kind of hear it. Yeah, you can kind of hear the, the the water like steaming and boiling um, under this other pan. Okay, my mom did say once you like you don't hear anything anymore, just pour more water on the bottom pan and let it steam up. What I was mentioning earlier about the banana leaves is that normally we would just put the meat in the banana leaf, right? And we would just like fold it, you know? I don't want to crease it, but you would just like fold it like a burrito and put it over, like tie it with some kind of like lemon uh, grass or something like that and put it over charcoal or uh, a fire pit. I don't know, anything that's cooking, right? Like fire. You would let that sit in there and let it steam the meat naturally, right? Now, what does the taste give you? It gives you like a... Like, it doesn't really taste like banana, but it gives you like a nice, uh, I guess tropical, right? Would you say, Adin? Like a, like a really fresh... Like a rainforest kind of <laughs> taste. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah it, it just gives you like a satisfying <laughs> taste, you know? It just tastes really clean and really mm -hmm. fresh uh, yeah. with all the herb and ingredients. It's just, mm -hmm. it's just so filling. So I really encourage you guys to try this out. I don't know everything that my mom just put in that dish. I mean, like I know some stuff in my language, but I don't know it in English, right? If that make any sense. So, yeah, shout out to my mom hooking us up. Uh, me and my daddy, we're just gonna chow down, make some rice. I'm gonna make some deep fry and we'll see how it goes. Mmm, smells like water. It smells good. You don't say it smells like water, bro. It is, wa it is water steaming. He's pretending like he knows what he's doing. Sushi master right here. So I am making my like traditional every Louisiana, <laughs> yeah, every fisherman kind of deal where we just batter with flour with the Louisiana fish fry. Again, I'll show you guys what it is. If you guys haven't yet watched my recent video, it'll be a link down below. But it's this stuff right here. I love it. it smells so good. But this is what I'm making for my boy. I'm more excited with that than this. Yeah, because he don't like that tropical stuff. It tastes yeah. like the rainforest. <laughs> Alright guys, so I just made the nuggets. 
Bourbon nuggets? Yeah. Look at that right there. <sighs> Danny has never tried this before. And this is his first time. So go ahead, bro. You got that one? Mmm. Smells good. Mm. Oh, good? yeah, that's good. Have it. Whoa. There you go, guys. Yeah, that is really good. It's good, right? And you like, know, what? It doesn't taste like fish. No, it doesn't taste like fish. It does not taste like fish. And I'm picky about fish. Fish right. It's weird. And I, and I made him like catfish nugget before, and he can taste the like the fishiness. Even if I put it in sea salt and like like bland it all out. He can still taste it. I don't mind because I like fish. Wow. You good, right? That's good. Mm. Save me some. <laughs> yeah, that, that's really good. Yeah. That's really good. It's almost like the fish, the texture of it is different. It's different, yeah. Like, it, you can't really describe it. It's Yeah, it's different. It's, it's just, really different. It's just good, you know. Just a nap. You guys hear it from the pinky guy. Just from the <laughs> natural, like... This fish itself is so weird looking, but mm, it's so satisfying. But we're gonna enjoy this, and then we're gonna try out the dish that my mom just packed. So, and we're watching Naruto. Let's go! But yeah, this is mine. This is really good. Mm. My mama dropped off some rice, and the fish is ready. She also dropped off some like boiled chicken too, man. My mom is. Oh, how do I do that? <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> 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 Danny did that. Uh, we're too funny. We're funny people. No, we're not. Ah! How did she do this? She just like opened it without like. Yeah, they got like skin of steel, man. Yeah, dude. Oh, that smells so good. Can you guys smell that? But... Oh my. Yes, dude. Does it smell like the rainforest? I'm gonna steam up the rain. Sorry. Guys, oh my gosh, that is. That's oh, all the juice, all juice and everything. Man. All right, right. And break it up real quick. Whoa. That you guys are probably like, oh, what is that? Cat food? <laughs> Cat yeah. litter? Right. <laughs> no, 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 no. This is. Oh my gosh. I'm about to cry. It smells really good. It smells. It smells. Um, I just wish you guys were here to like see it and try, but we're going to eat. Let me show you guys if I like mess it all up, but that's what it is right there. No bones, right? I deboned everything already. It's hot. It's really hot. Mm. Whoa, that's good. Spicy, um, herby, if that's a word. Yeah. Whoa. Love it. Oh my gosh. Mm. Okay, okay, that's really good. It's only my mom would make it, guys. Mm. It's a bonus because your mom makes it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's good because she made it. Good. If we didn't say it was good, we got our ass beat. <laughs> <laughs> you know, <clears throat> I don't eat this kind of fish. Yeah, Danny's Honestly, the last person to eat fish steam like this. You know why I stopped eating fish, right? Because <clears throat> when I was younger, I choked on the <clears throat> fish bone. <laughs> I was like probably like six or seven mm -hmm. and I was choking and mom had to like put her finger <laughs> through my throat to grab <laughs> yeah, the fish yeah. bone. Yeah. I was like. <laughs> 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 Ever since then I got traumatized and then I, I stopped eating fish forever for good. Seriously. Well. <clears throat> Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. We're definitely enjoying this dish. And um, I know I don't eat fish a lot, but I've been doing it because of you guys. I mean, I only, I've only did it three times. I'm not eating fish every single day, right? It seems like you guys enjoy this stuff. It's like I do because my mom made it. And it's just... If you guys haven't yet, hit that subscribe button. Leave a comment down below. If you guys like seeing this stuff, let me know. And we'll do it again. Cool. All right, no real time.